and I should double check it. I never have. Um, <laughs> with impending indictments of many of his top aides, Nixon announced the results of his own investigation. <laughs> Okay, well, yeah, and I'm, you know what? You know, it's interesting. I've been investigating for a while now, and um, I didn't find anything. Oh, my God. And if anything, I actually found out that my penis is above average. <laughs> yeah. I found it's bigger than even I thought. <laughs> even I thought I was being very humble about it, apparently, and I also found $2 in an old jacket. So <laughs> <laughs> I've been investigating all pockets. Uh, case closed. <laughs> uh, no, that's, that's, that's not that far off. Uh, I never am. His own investigation (laughs) found no one in this administration presently employed was involved in this very bizarre incident. (laughs) Honestly, it's weird. I don't even understand it. It's so weird. But certainly none of us were involved. And I did a pretty thorough investigation to figure that out. According to Britannica, on April 17th, presidential spokesman Ziegler infamously told the press that all previous White House statements about Watergate were now, quote, inoperative. So, it's a, sort of like saying not canon anymore, I guess. It's a strange... So anything that we've said before, don't worry about that. This is the real story. Yeah, forget. Just none of that counts anymore. 